Item number SCP-072-TH Object Class Keter Special Containment Procedures All instances of SCP-072-TH are currently contained at their place of origin and fort. As it has proven impossible to immobilize or relocate them, focus has shifted to limiting their movement to the island on which the fort is located. To prevent trespassing, a perimeter armed guards have been placed around the island. Description. SCP-072-TH consists of several sets of full metal plate armor constructed in a style typical of 13th century Europe. Radiological tests indicate that the interiors of SCP-072-TH are hollow, however an unknown symbol or alphabet is carved into the inner breastplate of each instance. Thorough tests of SCP-072 remain unfeasible, due to the inefficacy of conventional sedatives as well as the behavior of SCP-072-TH upon disassembly of the armor. Instances of SCP-072-TH are capable of independent movement. Their behavior is highly aggressive, and they have invariably displayed hostility towards any and all human beings thus far. Instances of SCP-072-TH also demonstrate durability far beyond that of similar non-anomalous armor from the same time period, the limits of which have yet to be established. Instances of SCP-072-TH are self-repairing. Instances of SCP-072-TH possess the ability to transfer their consciousness to a different set of armor whenever the previous set becomes heavily damaged. It is unclear whether the anomaly itself has been copied onto the new set of armor, or the conscious entity simply discards the old set and activates a new one. SCP-072-TH instances also possess a broadsword, bearing engravings in an unknown language. Hostility from the anomalous entity prevents more in-depth studies. SCP-072-TH instances communicate with each other by vocalizing in an unidentified language, hypothesized to be a pidgin of Old Latin and Old Turkic but refused to communicate with Foundation staff due to their hostility. SCP-072-TH was discovered at Fort one of the oldest tourist attractions in after a group of tourists were attacked by possessed armor. Said incident led to the death of tourists and staff and a police officer were heavily injured. After the incident had been filed, Foundation intelligence agents embedded in the investigation team of the local police department successfully contained Instances of SCP-072-TH The Foundation contacted the local authorities responsible for the safety of the site, and disseminated false information that states that the fort has become unsafe due to old age and deteriorating structural integrity.